West Red Lake Gold is poised to take full advantage of the current strong gold price environment, with their flagship Madsen mine set to restart production in the second half of 2025. Madsen is built in permanent and sits atop 1.7 million indicated ounces of gold, in rock averaging 7.4 grams per tonne gold. It's the kind of strong gold grade that made Red Lake the high-grade gold capital of Canada. Will Robinson, Vice President of Exploration, takes us behind the scenes to highlight where the magic happens. Red Lake, you know, the district is, is very prolific historically. Over 30 million ounces of gold have been uh, pulled out of the ground in the rocks in Red Lake. You know, and that's significant in itself, but, but what's significant also about that gold that's been pulled out of the ground is it's also very high grade. And so that's been our focus, you know, for West Red Lake Gold is, is to focus on quality ounces, but also to focus on high grade ounces. And, and that's been our main focus also with all of our efforts during uh, the exploration that we've already completed and the infill drilling at Madsen, but also is going to be, you know, one of our main focuses as we restart the mine as well. So focusing on those high grade, high quality ounces in the ground. Right now we are in the, uh, the Madsen Mine core shack. So, a lot of the really good hands-on work and interpretation on the geology happens in here. You know, a lot of the unsung heroes, I guess, of, of many mineral projects are in the core shack. So every time we drill a hole, you know, that core comes from underground at Madsen, comes up to surface, comes into this core shack for processing. So this is really where we do a lot of the interpretation on the core. You know, we select the intervals of high grade that we want to then sample and get assays back for. And so this is uh, you know, kind of where the magic happens, so to speak, um, at least from an exploration and drilling side. 